I feel like such a, I feel like such a ball of slime. I'm just like, I'm gonna do NES games, and then I immediately jump the gun. And I'm like, oh shit, like, I could play the NES versions of the, or like the, the Game Boy Advance ports of these NES games and just get like double mastery on them. I mean, I'm already warmed up on them, right? It just makes sense to jump ahead. <laughs> Rather than using it as an excuse to like play them again down the road, I'm just like, no. What if I do it right now? <laughs> it's efficient! It is efficient! And I'm not efficient on stream very often. Alright. Oh, wow. This looks really weird on... on this. I'm like, there's no way this is visually running right. Oh my god, this looks so weird. Why is it... why does it look like this? Uh, why, what? It looks so wiggly. I'm just gonna adjust. Okay, that's... It's so weird, it's so strangely wiggly! Um... I could just... Uh, is a pair, is a pair wiggler, he is! I I have no idea what. Uh... Just one sec. I gotta like apparently cycle through this. Okay, um, okay, uh. boom, flip it, <laughs> maybe, here, I'm gonna load this in just so y'all can see this, what I'm seeing, because this is so weird, the other game I tested, like, on this, I was like, oh, this'll, it'll be fine, oh, it's, it's not having any of it, um, I'm gonna see if it's like just as wiggly on stream. Look at it! It's so wiggly! <laughs> I've never seen I've never seen I've never seen um uh, morning. Uh, why does it look like this? The actual game doesn't look like this, does it? The NES classic version of the game does not do this. It can't do this. This is too fucking weird. This, is, this can't can't at all be what it looks like. I'm like, no way. No fucking way. I mean, I could play it like this, probably. Oh, there we go. Okay, I fixed it. Apparently it was kind of, still looks weird, but I mean, like, this is, what a jump. This is, this is a weird looking version of the game, but you know what, fuck it, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do it anyways. Actually, I gotta exit out just for a split second, because I gotta switch my controller. Huh. I'll actually use this as a chance to refresh my tracking. This is my, it's, it's, it's mildly cursed Mario, yeah. I figured it would look a little bit different, but like, I was like, it's probably fine. Hmm. Yeah. It's just only a little bit cursed. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah. Alright. There we go. I'm like, it's only a little curse. It adds character here. Yeah. Okay. And let's load this in. Can't believe how wiggly it is. And load our achievement tracker. Uh. This in. Mm. 
All right. There we go. All right, I'm back. Um, and Super Mario Brothers, uh, NES Classic, Classic Series, Retro Achievements, and this is under Retro. Boy, it's been, it's been a journey. Okay, I mean, it, like, kind of, it's... Apparently I have to load it in every time this way. It's weird. I mean... Why is it being so particular about this? Like, look at this, trying to figure it out. So we're gonna open our achievements list. We're gonna open our focus. All right. Uh, going to I'm like, do I shrink down the title? Boy, I'm shrink down the title just a little bit. It's gonna look weird. I don't do that very often. Right, and the game. <laughs> now we just have to get the game to load in. It's so weird looking. It's such a weird looking version of Mario. <laughs> Frames blended. Okay, this is, yeah, this is cursed. All right. Um. Okay, and we need our game audio, which is. I assume piping into the right source, but yes, it is. Okay. Um, all right. So we're going to load that in. We're going to move this over. We're going to move our tracker over. Um, most of these are just like standard. So we're just going to be doing a playthrough for the bulk of them. It's, uh, uh, I mean, like, We'll focus on this first, I guess. Doing We're doing the long run. Now, what the fuck is this? This is the classic NES series Super Mario Brothers. All right, y'all ready for this? The, the most cursed Mario? Oh, why is it like this? Oh, it feels all wrong. This is, nope, this is just a, not the, this, this version is, it was a mistake. This was a mistake. Oh, it's because um, my controls are definitely not like working. Uh, configuration. I'm like, oh, okay, that's right too. This is like for whatever reason, this like emulator just crashes every single time I try to change the controls. So that sucks. So. Here we are. Achievement number one. Get used to playing the game. Ugh. Man, I just can't have anything work. I've been, I've been like, cursed. It's not even just the game. Just everything about... Everything about doing retro achievements is just kind of fucking curse. Okay, let's just try it with this controller. See if this one also crashes the emulator. Uh, achievement number one. Get used to playing the game. So after the fight with Elena Rude, do you still think that you can stick to the story and be fine? Yeah, no, I think so. I mean, the second the second run was like I completely like wiped them, so I think it's fine. It's not going to be like a hundred percent like easy. Are you sure not hitting a pause hockey? No, no, it's like it's literally just it's I'm even like hitting the pause key like manually right now all right okay let's see i'm gonna see if this crashes if it just crashes whenever i touch this 
yeah, I hear my computer rev up and then the inputs just crash. Man, just can't have anything, anything nice, can I? Yeah, but we love, we love it when the, the joypad configuration crashes immediately. And... Okay, this control isn't going to cut it either. So it's not, it's probably not tied to the controller. So let's pick it out. Let's switch it back. Alright. Alright, let's try this again. Okay, so what is crashing here? Loud joystick background input. There could be any number of things that are like fucking this up. Yeah, just even opening up the like configuration panel. I don't know if you can hear it from here. But my computer goes into high fan and it just crashes. It just crashes the whole thing. My god. Terrible. What the, what the hell's wrong with my computer? I tested this earlier with a different game, but I figured that, like, the controls were already fine. They were set and they were fine, so it was like, okay, it's not a big deal. But, but here we are. Uh, it's like, we'll see how it works out. Okay, we're just gonna, we're gonna wing it. All right. Uh, all right. To be fair, like the fight, the first round with a uh, Lena and Rude, I really fucked up like hard in a way that was like not something that you'd normally do. <laughs> Most people would not make the mistake I made. I basically put myself in defense and did nothing to fix that. Okay, like. What is our run key? We we don't we don't have a run. I guess I won't know. I guess I won't know until I get a fire flower. My other button is. I I would assume. All right. I'm trying to get all oh, this fucking working. God damn it. There's a one up. There's a fire flower. Oh god, that's our that's our God, that's our run button, seriously? Oh, it's such an awful button by default. Seriously. Not a good time, that's what uh, I will say. I'm glad there's no pacifists and like cleanup achievements on this one. There we go. I'm having to do that thing where you have to hold your I'm having to hold my thumb across the Not to get blue, but Mario looks like he wants to in this version. He does! Man. That sucks. But this is like the worst. I can't even change the controls! Like, I've run worse setups. People have run worse setups. Yeah. Um, no, we want to go low here. I'll just get used to it. Some 
working on some coin achievements. And then we got... This one right here. There we go. This is... We're gonna take the longest route. This definitely doesn't, like, look right. But now that, now that I have, like, my, my run button... A run button. I should say a run button. Uh, doesn't feel the worst. It's still better than the All Stars version of Super Mario Brothers. Somehow, <laughs> I don't. I don't even. I don't even know how to explain that one. Boy, this the the fucking um. But. That version, that version of Super Mario Bros. is just awful. The physics are all wrong. It's just a bad time. This just feels like it's like Super Mario Bros., but it's run on like a resolution that like a watch could run. <laughs> like that's that's what it feels like. The only version of the game I've ever beaten oddly enough. That's wild. But I, I... I can tell you, Aang, that you've played the hardest version of Super Mario Brothers because it's basically Super Mario Brothers if you had no, like, good run physics. Even this has, like, physics down, so that's, that's good. And if you played Lost Le the Lost Level version of Super Mario All-Star, the Lost Levels version of Super Mario All-Stars, that is, that is an incredible feat. I would not I would not wish it upon my worst enemy. Do not recommend. Yeah, I don't recommend. Because knowing Mario physics is even more important in lost levels. Like I can still buzz this. I think I can still fly through this. The biggest thing that bothers me right now is my buttons, the fact that I can't switch my buttons around. That's that's really annoying. Uh, so you recommend it? Yo, hey Ruby, how you doing? <laughs> Mario has no chin in this version, it's weird. They stole Mario's chin! Actually, uh, I think the one-up is, like, right here, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. There we go. I have to try to remember where all these are located. I don't know if they're, like, longest root achievement that we're working on, uh, in this one means you can't use pipes or not. You, I think you're allowed to use pipes. Oh no! Whoa! No! Sphera, how you doing? How's this going? Longest route is still, like, popped. It's still, like, active on my, like, little bar here. Rain Dog, how you doing? No, so I think we can the <laughs> get the brakes. Yo. Man, I wish I could change these buttons around. I wonder if we could change them in, like, the other settings, but I don't think it would make much difference. Might be worth trying. So, I would be switching circle and square. Okay, let me see if I can do this real quick. Just out of curiosity. Um, make a profile duplicate.
Because it'll pick up my speed if I can, like, switch these. I wonder if that'll work. I don't know. No. Okay. Let's try that again. Is it still reading it the same way it is? Okay. I'm trying to change the buttons in like the actual like controller software, but I don't think that's gonna work that way. Hmm. Oh, Pokeball. Oh. Rain Dog hasn't spin. With all the Mario, Mushroom Mario eats, I wonder how much of an adventure is just a dream from being high. I don't think, I don't think if the mushrooms made, made people high, I don't think they just leave them in blocks like that everywhere. <laughs> Aw, Sphera. Yo, where's my Pokeball? Where is it? <laughs> I'm having one of those moments where I can't find my flow. Ugh. Well, I guess I could just beat... I could just beat, uh... Beat Super Mario Brothers with suboptimal controls. That's. Oh wait, I didn't actually assign it. Did I actually uh, edit? This, this is. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Now will work. Oh my god, I fixed it! Holy shit! Holy shit! I fixed it in the other software. We're in. We're cooking. Let's go. There's nothing that can stop us now. Uh, woo! The only thing I don't have is like oh, auto fire buttons, but that's okay. I don't need them. Like it's not important. It was only important for the uh, money achievements, which this game doesn't have. So that's awesome. So we can, we're gonna start flying now. I ain't got. I'm like I ain't got no reason to be here anymore. There we go. Uh, there we go. Uh, good. Picked up the guitar after several years. Uh, oh, very good. Uh, I should really learn how to play a musical instrument. Would y'all watch me learn how to play an instrument? What instrument should I play? How is he throwing fireballs underwater? Mario's talented like that. Mm. Oh. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie. Even though, even though this... This game, it's funny because I know I complained about the NES version being, like, super jittery on the emulator I was using. This version's, like, jittery, but in, like, a different way. But because it's jittery, it's jittery in, like, a different way. It's, like, less of an issue. It's not jittery in the way that was bothering me with the NES. It's so much worse, but it's, like, also not nearly as bad. Slap the base. Oh, gotcha. I'm gonna just check a quick thing here. Uh, Super Mario Brothers. Uh, maps. Where's, where's, uh, Ian Albert? There we go. There's, there's Ian Albert. Um, where's our mushrooms? I just gotta figure out where our mushrooms are. Oh my gosh. Okay, our next one is in 2-4. Alright, 2-4. So the Bowser's castle. Seriously? What? Wait, what? 
Oh, never mind. Complete the quest in two four. Where's the next mushroom? Uh, three one. All right. As let's say, the double mushrooms in Bowser's Castle in this game. Three one, and three one. Okay, it's the one on the bridge. I could have could have guessed that. I could have just guessed that one. So anyways, <laughs> I'm like, fuck. Okay, that was our no deaths, but that's fine. I wasn't expecting to get that. Mario has no neck! They've stolen Mario's neck! <laughs> this is such a cursed version of the game. <laughs> I'm wondering if it's just like displaying incorrectly or what the problem is. I think it, I think it actually does look like this. Oh my God, the way Mario crouches. I'm like, man, I mean, we should look up a video or two just to, like, make sure. Why is this head a blob? I know, right? It's not fine. I guess I can't get that coin. <laughs> look at his cr crouching. His nose, like, becomes a single row of pixels. I have, through, through the, through our previous run in Super Mario Brothers, it prepared me for this run. I'm now completely, like, in tune to play suboptimal Mario. Like, I'm, I'm, my, my capacity for Mario is unmatched now. I'll play, I will play the least optimal Marios. I don't love it. It's so weird feeling. Have you actually seen... Uh, have you actually seen Least Optimal Mario? No? Oh, uh, what? It's not gonna give me the mushroom, huh? Because I just got a one-up. Okay. No, no one-up in... It's called Super Mario Special on the PC 88. Oh no. I'm gonna have to play it too. I'm gonna have to play it too, aren't I? This is like a title, right? Like I gotta I gotta achieve this now. It's Mario on a console that can't do scrolling. Oh god! What's it do instead? Is what I ask nervously. Not knowing, not wanting to know the answer. Is it? Oh no! Oh no! I'm gonna have to play suboptimal Mario. This is this is my thing now. I play I play the worst versions of Mario Brothers. Let's see if we can do the shell thing. Let's see, let's see if we can do the shell trick. Oh no! I missed it. Don't want to try it again. Yeah, we can go for it. Let's see if we can get see if we can get it going. Behold. I gotta see this. I'll do it after we get our shell our shell one ups. There's actually a beanstalk right there too. That could be using, but uh, we're gonna just give it a couple, a couple free, free attempts. It's like, honestly, I'm actually surprised that, like, I guess it makes sense because it's like a resolution issue that, like, that this is addressing. Ah. Uh, Maybe they fixed it. I don't know. That didn't. That felt like it should have been it. Can you imagine if you can't do the? I mean, there's no achievement for doing the one-up trick in this version, which might be kind of telling. Okay. Well, if that's the case, then we're gonna play a little bit more cautious. I think. I could have got one up there. I think I only used like 
had like a life or two uh, last time I did a full playthrough, so I don't think we were having to worry about this too much, but still. The brick jitter is what spooks me most. I don't know if it's like this one stream or not, but the bricks jitter a lot. Mm, Alright, I'm gonna take a look at this. I'm like, I just gotta take a quick look. Oh my god, what are, what are we looking at? Oh god. Oh, so it's like a bunch of individual screens you have to clear. I gotta, I gotta show y'all this. I'm like... It's so cursed, it is cursed. Uh... Look, look at this, look at this. This is apparently the PC-88 uh, Super Mario Brothers special. Oh, it's done by Hudson Soft. Wow. That's super weird. It certainly is special. Oh no. Here's the music. Man, the stages aren't even in the right shape! That's like almost, almost even more aggravating. Don't do this, Code. There's a lim- Even I have limitations. <laughs> I'm gonna- Jesus. That's that's the Super Mario Brothers. You just have to like be like, God damn. Not today. Not tomorrow. Not ever. Let's try to speedrun that during a Mega Man DOS days. Oh my god, how did that go? That is the type of shit that Liz gets up to. I I could see it. Like, the thing is, at least this is, like, true to the original. It might be a weird port, but it's still, like... It's still at least, like, Super Mario Brothers at its core. Mm. She tried it for a single stream. Oh. That's really telling, too. <laughs> this doesn't give up too easily. <laughs> Yeah, okay. Oh, what? Seriously? Okay. There's definitely, like, a grossness to this, or, like, certain things. Your momentum feels a little bit weird. Like, it's just, like, a little bit. I don't want to say, like, low, but, like... Oh! Oh! Okay, Azu, what are you doing? Buddy, you are jumping a lot- wow. You're jumping a lot. Fuck. You know what? I was standing there basically forever, so I deserve that. Oh, cool. 
I like the broken set of pixels in the mushroom. That can't be intentional, but... See, what worries me is I wor I'm worried that I'm running this, like, suboptimally. Like, it's that it's some setting that I need to adjust. But I don't think it is. I think it just is. I think it's just gonna look like this. It's just... This is just the kind of Mario we're playing today. Oh, Bowser turned around. I'm like, I gotta know. Super Mario Brothers. NES Classic Collection. Super Mario, or er, Classic Series. Super Mario Brothers. Full playthrough. Let me see. I gotta see a long play of this thing. Show it to me. Show it to me, internet. Hmm. Yeah, no, it just looks like this. It's just weird. It's just a weird looking game. I suspect that the jittering probably isn't something that's noticeable on the Game Boy Advance, but it's like noticeable on. Yeah, it's noticeable probably on like something like an emulator where it's gonna run the game much clearer. Much visual. Like, visually much clearer than what, uh... There we go. Oh, there's gonna be a 1-up in this stage, too. Uh, 4-1. Uh, it's on top of the next set of boxes. I'm like, I wonder if I could just, like, make the screen size, like, if I can rescale it to, like, four times. I'll make, I made it even bigger. Hmm. Uh. Yeah, this stuff looks a lot better on the small screen. Yeah. It's... Uh, um... Here. Just gonna scale this in here again. Right. And also, I'll move the achievement list over so it's not clipping the stuff. Game, Game Boy games run a little bit wider than what uh, a lot of the NES stuff is set for, so... Um, there. Just some, just some general housekeeping. There. Alright. Sorry about that. That was just stuff that was like standing out to me that is like you know i should do something about all this all right all right okay oh, oh not there uh here okay for whatever reason we're, we don't we're not meeting the criteria of a one up there i don't know what the criteria oh, my instincts my instincts took over on the first one, and I was like, oh, shit, I'm actually surprised I made that. <laughs> oh, shit. Actually, let's hit this, because where we didn't do the shell trick, we do want to get lots of coins. A lot of weirdness with the GBA is noticeable on the actual hardware. Yeah. yeah it's, it's funny like that. <laughs> I like the fact that he doesn't have a neck. Yeah. Chinless Mario, Nicholas Mario, any percent. Ugh. Didn't like any of that. That felt really, really gross. It's right here. Right here. Right here. Much of a difference. A single uh, 
Yeah, I know, a single se yeah, a set of pixels in the neck make. Broly, how you doing? What you up to? Approximation, though, it's like pretty close. She's fine. <laughs> all of that, all of that is really touch and go. I didn't have momentum in any of the right places for any of that, but we still made it. Oh my god. Been a ride. First, yeah, top first. And then top and bottom. Mm. But it was like where I'm kind of like in shape for Super Mario Brothers right now, like it felt like the right idea to play this now. Get a double platinum out of it. Why not, right? Thank you, Mario. Our princess is in another castle. Actually, here. I should be, like, letting the achievements cycle through. Uh... There we go. Um... Okay, where's the extra life in this one? Uh, this is 5-1, five, five, is it? Five one. Uh, the extra life is right. I know this one. My familiarity. Honestly, if there's one like big benefit that came from doing the treasure hunt uh, achievements in the NES version, it's the fact that it made me familiar with like a lot of the positions of like pipes and coins and things. So as soon as like I look at it, as soon as I glance at the map, I'm like, oh, okay, it's this one. Nothing. Keep our coins. Keep our coin numbers up. Because, like, this is still different enough that I'm gonna spend some lives, probably. So we're over halfway through now. Good. 
Okay, so there's a pipe here, but there's also a beanstalk coming up. And the beanstalk would be better, better value than the pipe. feel easier, and that's- that's really weird to me. at me. Did I hit that in the other direction? Did, did, I, did I get the lights display on that shell? What the fuck? shell. That's a fact I'm gonna probably take to my grave. <laughs> I'll tell it to my many grandchildren. I'll be like, and this is the stage where you get to kill a bullet bill with a shell, and they'll be like, okay, Grandma. Go back to bed. Was it worth the wait for suboptimal Mario? Not the least suboptimal Mario, but the sec probably the third. Mm. We'll, we'll make a tier list. Absolutely. <laughs> okay. Good. Now this should be the long bar. How's how's the Game Boy Advance? How's the Game Boy Advance gonna handle this? Actually, totally fine. Maybe the second. <laughs> maybe the second button. Yeah. Maybe the second best Mario, if anything. You're right. You might be right on that one. Even bi even on the Bizhawk, that was like harder to do. That's unbelievable to me. <laughs> that was actually easier than on the Biz. What? Shit! Running it on Bizhawk. Unbelievable. than what I realized. Mm. Okay. Mm, this one's not looking good. I feel like I feel like the death the death cycle is gonna be sh strong on this one. I wonder how this measures up to Mario on the Dendy. Dendy? Ah, oh, man. Like I said, I feel the death cycle kicking in. It's not a stage you really want to die in. The wait time on that mushroom is, like, too long. It's not easy to reliably get that mushroom. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. What's up, Bandito? How you doing? Dendy. I don't know. I'm kind of 
curious about that too. One, only a couple stages left. Uh, six one. I know where the mushroom is. Can do it by memory. It, like didn't just like fall right down onto me is shocking to me. Actually, I don't know if it's right there. Let me double check that. Six one. No, it isn't. It was actually the other spot. But we haven't been able to get one up so far, so I don't know what's going on. Morgan, how you doing? Hate that cloud guy. Look at Bowser, he's way worse. <laughs> like it too. This is the stage with all the pipes. So there's a lot of coins here. We can definitely use a couple lives for the road in this. Good, we'll just go to bed. It's 5 a.m. My time's on. Aw, oh, good shit. Mm. Oh shit, this is not ooh, this is not the pipe to go down. not a big deal, I guess. We still had some points, but we're gonna miss the beanstalk in the stage now. But Ah, oh, crap. Uh, well, let's hope for the best. There we go. some coins. Like Super Mario World. Yeah, Super Mario World's really good. I look forward to doing the achievement stuff from Super Mario World, even though a little bit I've, like, peeked ahead. It doesn't... It looks a little bit, like... I don't want to say annoying, but, like, it looks a little annoying. <laughs> Should do a sequel to it. It did with uh, Yoshi's Island, but I know what you mean. <laughs> Yoshi's Island, uh, it's also known as Super Mario World 2. The only real hard ones in Super Mario World are the small Mario challenges. Ah, gotcha. say lying through my teeth.
Like, I think you actually have a little bit more screen real estate in this version, but it's just like... It's the weird flickeriness of it. Oddly enough, I think playing the BizHawk version of this may have, like, trained me for this version. <laughs> I knew it. I fucking knew it on that part. will be a little bit tough. At least we're past the big fire bar. So we don't have to worry about that. I just have a little fire bar. Ugh. Damn, we're not gonna make it. That's okay. No. Easy come, easy go. Ooh. Spicy. There's gonna be a fucking lock here. There we go. Okay. You got Bowser. You got hammers too, don't you? Oh! He just stuck it. Stuck it in my butt. Sucks. Ah, fuck. I felt it. There's like a little bit more like I don't want to say scroll speed going on here, but like it's it's weird. It's just weird. It's a weird feeling. Okay. Mm, jumped too early. Jumped a little too early. I wanted to go early so that I could try and get that mushroom, but... Oh, uh, okay. So, we're just going to... There we go. Okay. Might as well just continue the playthrough. So, we can't do the con no continues, but that's okay. We can at least get our stage clear. Ah, I love it. Thank you. Underville will give me the one up here now. Ew. Okay, well that's an achievement. So it counts for something. Ugh. It is what it is. I'm not too worried about it. We'll get our first passive, like, clears, and then we'll probably... I don't know what we'll do. I probably don't have it in me tonight for another whole pass, but... Alright. What we're 
definitely getting our second mastery of this, there's no question. Good job, me. Genius. Well, well played. Smart. <laughs> Fuck. Alright, Baz, you have a good night, okay? Thanks for hanging out. It was good seeing you. Hanging out. But hope you enjoyed the stream. That was the immense amount of bait there. I was gonna die every way. <laughs> every 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 possible way that could have killed me there would have killed me, but um I guess that's the way I should be doing it, is jumping onto the brick first instead of trying to, like, get the mushroom and all of them in one go. Except you can't grab it and do that. Nah. Kills your momentum. The bait, it's real. Seven, so just two worlds left. Oh, fuck that! What? Okay, fine. This is only technically easier than everything I've been through. Because I don't have to fucking try and mash the coin block in front of a bullet. Well, that's cool, I guess. Seriously? Pretty sure there's. Yeah, I was pretty sure we can go down this pipe. Time 
is it? Oh, we're at 11 hours. Yeah. Kind of overran tonight, but... Yeah. Ugh. Oh, I, um... I wasn't expecting the Steam Next Fest demos to go as long as they did, and I wasn't expecting to have technical issues before I started the stream. And... stage I'm in now. I'm just... Kind of just clicked over my brain. Um... flower for this, but it's fine. At least I don't have to collect coins. Oh, Mario. Look at this coral, like, skill check. I had to be running Mario Chinless any percent. Whoa. Where's this one going? Oh! I hit the brakes. Oh my god. Oh, bots! Seriously? Oh. What a terrible... What? What a terrible night to have a fish. But I felt myself build up a tiny bit too much momentum there. Go. off the sides. Hmm. 
was like curious. So we're almost done our first first set, which is good. It's a, kind of a shame because I was hoping to stack the one up achievements with just the first pass, but for whatever reason, we don't have access to all the one ups. So that's just how it is, I guess. Just be like that sometimes. Them fish. <laughs> oh, it went right. Oh, jeez. It went right under me, and it, like I thought it was gonna eat all my momentum. Fish hit me in the butt. It made me jump. Okay. This is another maze castle. They're generally not so bad. No, no, no mushroom, though, unfortunately. Ugh. Um, bottom, middle, top. Bottom, middle, top. Top. Big block in this game. Ugh. Should have known. That was that was like so obvious. God damn it. Ah. Oh, be really careful in these. Oh shit! We didn't get our we didn't get our uh, continue. Can hold the button in hard enough, I guess. Blech. Okay, I guess we're warping warping our way there. I guess. Oh, good God.
Mario's kind of bean-shaped in this one. Honestly. Not too big of a setback, but oh shit! There. Seven or seven. I wish we were just going to world eight. <laughs> uh, world seven is somehow kind of worse for me than world eight, and I think it's mostly just because world eight, like, because of the like, because of like the kind of softcore speedrunning attempts. Uh, like, I'm just used to world eight. World 8 keeps my attention. World 7 is just, I don't know, it's like you go in and it's just like there's bullets and everything, but like, is it really that interesting? I don't know. I wonder if I loaded this, like, I wonder if I had have loaded this game up and then loaded, like, the other game up. Um, the NES version up, and if I tried to play them both at the exact same time, if they would actually work, you know what I mean? Like, off of one controller, do a double play of this, these two versions to see if it actually works. I can't even set my buttons on in the, in the I can't even set my buttons in the emulator itself, so it's like I don't know what makes me think I could run a double play of this. The actual hurdle is the software itself. What? 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 Where did the Humber brother come from? Did I not just kill him? What the fuck was that? Did anyone just see that? Did you just jump it? Mario desires freedom. Not like this. This is why I hate World 7. 
right here. This is this is the bullshit the World Seven has in it. Too many fish. This is the fish zone. Mario dislikes the fish song. I would dislike the fish song. into this castle with a mushroom makes a big difference. Oh, I should have tried for the extra hidden mushroom in this stage. Shit. I forgot. Bottom. Middle. Top. You know what's great? Not having to collect all the coins in this stage. That's awesome. Just, just awesome. My brain was like, there's a thing there. And I'm like, is it? Oh, oh, what? Sealers, uh, how you doing? Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, oh god, yeah, okay. It's that little initial burst of, like, momentum that feels weird in this. It's like... And I don't know, it's just... I don't know if it's just the scaling or what it is. It doesn't feel, like, super wrong or anything. It just feels weird. an achievement for... Uh -oh. For getting, um, one of the tier. Whoa! <laughs> Which is just a good thing to get to. I think it's mostly, but I guess it just, like, looks different, so, you know. The little things like, like, measuring stuff out and checking distances, you know, like, it makes you feel unsure. What version is this? This is the, uh, classic NES series Super Mario Brothers. so for the Game Boy Advance, it's the Game Boy Advance port of Super Mario Brothers. That's why Mario doesn't have a neck, and why when you're Big Mario, he doesn't have a chin. Because I was like, I got my mastery for the NES version, and I'm like, well, I'm warmed up on the game. And then I checked the, like, the classic NES for the classic NES series version of it. I was like, oh, this achievement list is, like, 200% easier. So I was like, you know what? I'm willing to try it. I'm definitely gonna double master. Like, there's no question. Like... That is, that is guaranteed. Oh. 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 Yeah. How you doing? I'm doing good. We yeah, that's same as the original. Doesn't quite doesn't quite hit a piranha plant at that range. I'm curious if the shell would still be glitched in that situation because that's like a really annoying glitch that the turtle shell, the Koopa shell back there, can't hit the hammer bro under normal circumstances. So yeah. I'm doing good. How's things been? What you been up to? Slow. Like I said, this this game feels a little bit weird with like the careful movements, and it might just be because like it's widescreen, it's in a different ratio. Yeah, yeah, you have to manipulate the stream the screen a little bit to make it hit. I'm curious if this version would actually have the same like issue. I suspect it would because it feel it feels like fairly one to one. It's just like at a different like screen ratio. That said, it seemed really hard to get, like, the 1-up trick to work. We, in fact, didn't get it working, so of it. Uh, we didn't get it working, so that feels strange to me. But... We're just taking this whole section slow and steady. 
feels a little bit too, like... It just feels kind of alien right now. Oh, fuck. God damn it. That's, that's the worst. No, the worst is going for your pacifist achievement and then having a fish, like, bonk you in the ass when you're standing there. Because, like, then you've ruined your pacifist achievement and have to do all of World 8 over again. Because you just weren't ready for the fish, fish RNG. Been drawing, just finished a couple big pieces. Oh, hell yeah, nice. Very good. Okay, we're gonna go fast. Gotta go fast. Whoa! Fuck it! Ah, uh, mm -mm. wasn't ready for the fish up the ass. <laughs> yep, pretty much. Ah, uh, what? Okay. This is gonna be a little bit more dicey now. The fact that you have to use that coin block to reach the uh, treasure hunting achievement and it still feels wrong to me. It was kind of, I guess there was like kind of a nice fanfare to it, but it was still just like weird. <laughs> I just realized Swing Mario is just like all body. It's just a pair of legs. Oh, it felt weird. Dang, I just noticed Blizzard has a couple of its Diablo games on sale uh, for Valentine's. Day, and on one hand it's Blizzard, but on the other hand it's Diablo. Let's see. Hmm. Oh, okay. One more. No, bad hammer. Wait for it. He's gonna walk soon. Hey, Belly, how you doing? We did it! Mm. Mm. Nice dress, thank you. Yo! So, as much as... Why did it put me at World... Oh, okay, never mind. Uh, so... As much as I want to do another run right now, because there's another whole set of achievements in the second quest, um, honestly, everything ran so much later tonight than I was planning that I don't think I'll do it tonight. I'll save it for another night. Because we're at 11 and a half hours, which is already a pretty long stream. But we did over half the list. We're at 56%. This just leaves a second run of the game in uh, for the second quest. You've been streaming for nearly 12 hours. Uh, like, <laughs> this is this is pretty on par for yeah for things lately. Um, so yeah, like I feel a little bit bummed that we didn't do longest run, but we're getting used to this version too. So, but this basically entails the bulk of what's left. Um, so, we're gonna have to do the whole second quest, which is fine, it's not dramatically different. Um, and we're gonna have to beat, uh, the game without dying is Mario, which, that's doable, it's easy enough. Um, collect 1-ups, uh, in world 3-1, 5-1, 7-1, and 8-1, so, I guess we'll probably have to go out of our way to collect those. Um and uh be the longest uh game as mario without using continue which is once again that's not actually that bad it's just a matter of like getting our pace down for it so but yeah not not too bad at all um okay well this this version leaves a little bit to be desired <laughs> just just a little bit kind of a little bit weird but you know um, hmm. 
I should wrap, but also like. What if I played classic Donkey Kong? I'm <laughs> like, what if I played classic NES series Donkey Kong? One run! One run of Donkey Kong. Uh, which is currently at 60%. Just one run. It's cool. Just one more run. Exactly. Uh, I'm gonna do this because for some reason they decided it would be a good idea if this one. Uh, open. Recent. Stop. No. <laughs> uh, uh. Uh. It's time. It's time for monkey. Yes. No. 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 Please, please, see horse. There's achievements that need to be achieved. We can't achieve them if we do. Oh. Okay, so uh, finish loop one, game A, without dying. So uh, we're just gonna do, we're just gonna do a set in loop uh, in game A. Wait, this didn't, this did not. I see that it didn't trigger. Um. Reset? What do we want to do here? Reset. Uh, keep climbing game A. Get high score. Game A, high score. Okay, there we go. Huh, for some reason it wasn't loaded incorrectly. That's really weird. Okay, whatever. So... Anybody that was watching uh, watching the stream at the beginning of this year, this was one of the first games that I did retro achievements for. Um, I did them for the NES version, and <laughs> should probably do it on the arcade version at some point, which is considered the better version of the game. But oh, oh. Man, Donkey Kong, eat my ass. Okay, take it from the top. All the fucking things. Oh, there we go. Okay. Oh my god, that's a good water bottle emote. I like that. So we're going for two achievements here. One which is for doing our loops without dying. And uh, the other one is for a score of 100,000, which I can definitely do. Those are two barrels in that. That's interesting. This definitely seems like the better list and the better version versus the NES version. The NES version's list. list Oh my god, Donkey Kong has it in for us right now. Uh, the NES version of the list is, like, kind of a little bit repetitive in a weird way. Um, this version only has one scoring achievement, or, well, it has two scoring achievements. It has one for 40k on game A and one for 40k on game B. Um, which is, like, actually, you know what? Okay, so I can't truly say this is the best version because it does have a weird quirk, which is the elevators aren't smooth. They're weird. Like, I don't know if you can see it on stream, but they, like, kind of stutter in a weird way. And, I don't know. They're, they're very, they're very strange to me. Like, they look kind of weird. Yeah, they're super jut- yeah, right? I'm like, that's really weird. I'm gonna take the- oh, we, s we smacked our butt on the floor. God damn, I went too high. I don't know, let's focus on those elevators. Yeah, they're weird. They're strangely like jittery. I don't know. I don't know why that is. I don't know how that. I don't know how that passed inspection. Shouldn't have. Okay. 
Get the initial jitters out. Y'all have fun? Alright. Eh. Oh, that's... Wow, that is a bad situation. Man, maybe this isn't meant to happen right now. We're going through, going through, we're going through it. Which is really wild because I mastered this game like at the beginning of January. Go to sleep. No. I wouldn't be going to sleep for another like five, six hours anyway, so. So, I don't know about those jittery elevators. I don't know how that will, like, factor into things, but... I don't like the- I don't like the look of them. I think the scoring achievement's a little bit higher for this version, but not, like... Not, like, dramatically higher. But it's not tied to an individual game, like it is on the NES set. this trick, but not this early at least. Alright. You got this. Thank you. But uh, I wouldn't be I wouldn't be getting to sleep for another couple hours, so Get up here, get bonked. Get bonked, idiot. God, I want to play Donkey Kong 94. That game is so good. There we go. Finish loop one. Uh, I always wonder why fireballs on this stage look different from all the others. Just one moment. Uh, if nothing else, we can still keep going for our score. I mean, 
one-fifth the way there, so I guess it still counts for something. On speed two, so the springs are a little bit more threatening, but not like a lot more threatening. Three and four is where things start to get a little bit more, get a little bit more taxing. Fuck the bag. It's like eight. It's like eight thousand points. I mean, we basically spent eight thousand points just. Could probably get some points out of that, but oh shit, I went showing on the other side, got the umbrella. That was dumb. Uh, wasn't thinking. Yeah, well. Also, since we're not lined up for this one, we will aim for uh, this one. Which is which is a better way to do the scoring achievement. Just tied to either game mode. That just makes sense. I mean most people get it in game A, but you know. It's real. <laughs> Boy. That 
this pixel perfect. Faded by the barrels, I know, right? <laughs> I don't like, like, locking my hammer out like that, but it kind of felt like the right thing to do in that situation. I'd still a little get something out of it. Uh, just a little bit. Just a little bit something something. Yeah. Like if it didn't. <laughs> Come on, fight me. Get up here. I'll bonk you. Like Icarus when you flew too close to the barrel. Yeah. Is it two? Oh, no, no. We're on four. Okay. So we're on level four. This is where level, the second stage gets really, like, tricky. Same setup as last time. That other run. That's know, that's a tough one. Oh, we're stuck at the top of the stairs. The ladder. don't want to be standing there for too long because Donkey Kong can just throw a fucking barrel at us. I'm just, I'm just like, it's one of my personal rules, like, don't stand anywhere where a, a gorilla could just throw a barrel at you. Just seems like a good rule to live by, really. If you are standing there, don't stand there for a long time. Woo! <laughs> fuck it! Time to fucking die! What if I just- what if I just miss my elevator in fantastic fashion? Why- why the hell not? I'm gonna take the long route. I know I could jump off on the second floor there, but I'm not gonna even bother risking it. Just take the long route. The point difference is like, whatever. So this is, this is where things get really like, sketchy. Ooh, 
You're always looking for a spring that's the closest on the left side. So, like, at that point, if you're not getting the one that's on the far left side, boy, you, like, your frame advantage is, like, really, really narrow. I hate leaving that one on the bottom like that, but... This one always feels like such a waste of time. more lives, but maybe we'll hit 100k. We just have to do the next run, like, perfect, basically. The next two stages would do. If we get the next two, it'll be, like, probably enough. It's like the hardest fucking thing in the world to do. And we just we did it like we did three things there that were basically awful. Oh my god. I mean it was amazing, but it was awful. Ah! Man! Well, 26 highest scores, I guess pretty good. It was a pretty pretty like Man, I did something amazing that I just walked into a barrel like an idiot. Fuck. Gross. Mm, it's like 12 hours. We're, we're, we gotta wrap. As much as I want to play another run. As much as I want to play another run. Get my revenge. Uh, donkey will have to wait another day. Mm. Alright. That puts us at... 65%. So we should be able to like chew through the rest of these like over the next day or two, probably. Just just on the back end, because let's be real, I've played through both these games in full already. And yeah. Alright. Anyway, so how's everyone doing? How is everyone? Uh, hope everybody enjoyed tonight's stream. We went all over all we went all over the place. It was it was a full stream. Uh Oh. Yo, uh, Zeki, how you doing? If I'm mispronouncing your name, feel free to correct me. Uh, Persona 3 Reloaded? Ah, oh, very good. How is it going? Hey, let me drop you a follow. I'm back with Raiders. Oh, gotcha. Hey, Wolf. Mm. Isabel. Mm. Zeki, how you doing? Tick, tick, raid. Oh. Do you know what's up? Welcome, everybody. Welcome. Uh, Aiden, how's this going? How is how is Persona 3 uh, Reloaded going? There. We just start Persona, it's so pretty. Aww. Yeah, it is, it is really nice looking, isn't it? God, that menu. The menus are so nice in it. Gosh. Mm. It's fantastic. Aw, very good. It's like Zeke. Okay. Getcha. So... At least for the casual run in um, two different uh, classic NES series games, we basically did half them tonight. 
Is that case German, by the way? Oh, what was it German for? Uh, the menu. I just kept pressing Y to see the menu, right? <laughs> yeah, Will, welcome. So, we did pretty good. Half. Ah, tick. Yeah, it's such a long stream. Uh, ah, German for tick. Okay, gotcha. I see, I see. Every time it looks amazing. I love the design. Aw, oh, thank you so much. Thank you. I don't normally wear a princess dress, but it was kind of for for the theme of the last couple of games. Um, but yeah, uh, no, uh, tonight we played, we did four Steam, five Steam Next Fest demos, uh, Final Fantasy Ever Crisis, and then classic NES series Super Mario Brothers, and classic series NES series Donkey Kong. Uh, Angel Tail recommended we raid you. Aw, very good. Well, thank you. Hmm. I'm like, here, let me just, like, change it at this, so, before I see y'all off. Hmm. Uh, do, 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 do. Where is it? There we go. There we go. Yeah, uh, there we go. Hey, yes. Oh. Ara, ara, meow. But, yeah, so, welcome, everyone. Uh, I guess I should probably introduce myself for anyone that doesn't know me. Uh, I'm Code, also by Katie or Cat, she, they pronouns. I'm a variety bodega cat VTuber who usually streams three to four games a night, four to five nights a week. And I play my games to high completion, so I do go for achievements. I go for those platinums, those masteries, uh, those 100% when I can. And yeah, uh, yeah, you can see some of the games we're currently playing on the sidebar right over here. I'm playing uh, Go Mecha Ball and Momodora. Uh, Moonlit Farewell, and uh, Backpack Hero, and uh, Kumanju, uh Stranger's Requiem. That <laughs> was like, I had to remember the subtitle. Um, but yeah, uh, so for this week coming up, for this week coming up, we're going to be doing a Metroidvania double feature, which is going to be starting Thursday. So we're going to be playing Metroid and then Castlevania back to back, and we're going to be doing that for two days. Uh, both Thursday and Friday. Um, I have here for viewer pick, um, for viewer pick on Thursday, what we're probably gonna do, now this is just me throwing it out there, here's what we're probably gonna do. Probably gonna do, uh, I'm just gonna, like, slide it in here. We're gonna do a little bit more Ever Crisis, but we're still gonna do the we're still gonna do the viewer pick too. So it'll be a little little bit of maybe put it like even in between. So we'll do a little bit of Ever Crisis story mode. Uh, we'll do the viewer pick first. So put it like that. We'll tape that on there later. So we'll probably do something like that. We can do it on cleanup day too. I don't know. We'll we'll play it by ear, but I suspect we'll probably be doing a little bit. Because uh, I want to get my Ever Crisis stuff up to um, story content up. I was like, hey, how you doing? Um, and, and of course, the other thing we're probably going to be doing, because we didn't beat it tonight, is a little bit more classic series. Uh, classic NES series, Super Mario Brothers. This game is fucking weird. I'm, and I'm like, we're definitely playing it more of that, too. So, uh, we'll feel it out. It'll be in there somewhere. We'll just put in there somewhere but um yeah and sunday sunday is not going to be probably not going to be retro hours instead we're going to be doing uh we're going to be doing more steam next fest so we're just going to put that right in there i'll we'll just put it like that in the meantime even though i haven't picked up games yet i'll probably have some games picked out by probably saturday sometime uh, if you have any game recommendations, any demo recommendations for the Steam Next Fest for me to check out, uh, you can always drop them in the Discord. We have a recommendations or a... What the hell do I call it? I'm like, what is it called? Yeah, okay, it's called recommendations. You know, it's just drop me a note there of any cool uh, Steam Next Fest games you've played. And I might consider adding them to the list if it looks like it grabs my attention. So look for this particular thing if you want to do that. So... The first, the first four I picked out, mostly 100%, well, 100% out of my own interest. Um, so the next ones might be more more for, like, what people recommend. 
Um, so yeah, uh, so that's that's the plan for the week coming up. But uh, Metroidvania double feature should be really fun, so I'm really looking forward to that. I hope everyone else is like pumped for that. Um, but yeah, so uh, I think I think we're doing a okay. <laughs> How's everyone doing? Twelve hours. This is a full full size stream. I've been like letting my streams get a little bit like probably too long, but honestly, I should. I I I've kind of been wanting to like polish off a bunch of stuff. My problem is I keep filling it in with other games. I beat a game and then I'm like, what if I add two more games? And that's a problem. I gotta I gotta like uh, buckle down on that. <laughs> but you know. Mm. Oh. As long as the rhythm works for you. Well, that's fair. Mm. Ah, but anyways, so I'm gonna probably go get some food myself. Yeah. But Zeke, thank you for thank you for the raid. Sorry, sorry, it's right at the end of the stream, and I just wrapped up what I was playing. So uh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna bounce, but uh, let's see if we can find some way good to raid. Oh, it's really quiet today. I, mean, I guess it is a Tuesday. Tuesday into Wednesday is always kind of. It's not a lot of people streaming this time of day. Um, just like looking. Uh, Kaine, Kaine is streaming. Black Pie is also streaming. Um, Ari is streaming. So we have a few options. Yeah, it's nice to meet you. Mm. Yeah. And also, this is like on the later end of my time slot, so usually I am streaming earlier. Uh, Kane is playing what looks... It's not Minecraft, but it's like a Minecraft-like game. Uh, Blake is streaming Yoshi's Island, which is pretty awesome. Um, and Makari is... Looks like drawing. Drawing and maybe streaming uh, Grand Blue Fantasy Relink. Grand Blue, yeah. Maybe. Looks like draw. No, I don't know. Um. I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say. Like, maybe. We'll, we'll, we'll raid Blake Pie. So, anyways, thank you all for watching and hanging out tonight. I hope everybody enjoyed the stream. Uh, like I said, next stream's Thursday. Metroid, Metroid, Castlevania. Look forward to it. Um, that's pretty much everything. So thank you everybody who, you know, thank you everybody who dropped subs earlier and bits. And uh, thank you everybody, who, you know, thank you for following and help for just being here. Like, I super appreciate it. It's always good hanging out with y'all, and it's just it's just good vibes. So, uh, oh, like if I was playing Yoshi's Island, I love Yoshi's Island so good. <laughs> but so thank you everybody for being here. Uh, anyways, let's let's show Blake Pie some love, and I will catch y'all later. Uh, bye. Uh,